should I regulate depression and anxiety? Okay. Now you might think, oh yeah, this sounds reasonable. But, um, due to various circumstances, um, gr um grief, especially from like a very close loved one. Let's, let's say like, uh, you're married and then your partner suddenly dies. Uh, murdered. Oh, we can't let you be depressed for more than a month. Case solved. You're happy now, right? I mean, that's an extreme example, but there are many other examples. So to put like a time limit on, on grief and, and uh, to put time limits on how people process their feelings. No, I don't agree with that at all. Should I let people commit suicide? Okay, that's a tough one. That's a tough one. I would say prevent people, sure. I mean, I don't think of it like, you know, oh, it's a sin, it's a sin. But it's more... It's more of a waste, I would say. Hmm, sure. Sure. But I mean, you know, if people are going to do things, people are going to do things. Violence. Sometimes this gets a bit like um, quirky, like once it gets to like a branching path, it will automatically switch to that screen. When it's not, it's not like I checked. Like you can check, you can check by going in here. That's if I wanted to, but I don't want to. I'm just continuing on, and then it forces forcibly takes you to that screen. I don't like that. Should I allow rape to occur? <clears throat> Mm. Allow. Rape is a, an, an abhorrent crime. I'm just trying to think of like, is there a situation where... <laughs> I don't want to put myself in a box here and say, oh, rape is fine. That's not it. I'm trying to, you know, play devil's advocate here in my mind. You know, it's like, should I allow murder to occur? That's a different question. Should I allow to occur? Then again, what gives you the right to dictate people's... Like... With free will, it's a, it's an all or nothing deal, I think. You can't call it free will if you're stopping people from freely acting. So, what we're, what we're saying here is like, you know, like, okay, next question. Should I allow, like, child predators to touch children? Your first answer is going to be no, right? But again, we're getting back to the question of free will. Like, the ultimate question is, should I allow people to have free will? And then if you say, well, yes, then basically you're saying yes to everything. In a way. Because they all have possibilities of happening in a free will scenario. In like a real world realistic scenario. It is my control. This, this shit's my control. But, because I don't want to get cancelled on Twitch... Should I let people commit murder? Hmm, okay, well, under what circumstances would murder be ethical? Euthanasia? Voluntary euthanasia is, um, under the eyes of many people, technically murder. 
um, people with terminal Ill illnesses. Like they asked for the uh, to be unplugged for the uh, from the life support systems in, in the hospital and just allowed it to pass naturally. That is a, a kind of murder, according to many people. In war, soldiers kill people, but you know they're just following orders, and it's usually you know in defense of their country they don't want to be overrun by a dictator, aka Ukraine. It's the most extreme form of violence to, to take life. Should I let people commit murder? This is a very twisted question. On surface level you'd say, well no, 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 never allow rape, never allow murder. This is like... This is all like justification for the mind control. And I don't like that. I'd be very surprised that there's not a pedo question here. Should I let people commit murder? Let's just see how far the rabbit hole goes. Let's say no. I, I think I missed another comment. Yeah, I think I've missed another comment. <laughs> Sorry, whatever whatever was there, I can't see it in either window. Maybe it was like deleted from auto mod. If so, actually, if so, I should be able to check if it was caught in the auto mod filters. Okay, there's nothing in the auto mod queue. All right. Should I let people commit murder? I'm going to say no. Should I let hatred such as xenophobia or uh, homophobia exist? Yes. Oh, look at the cat's cradle there. Yeah, sure. Oh my god. Now this one will really get me banned on Twitch. Fuck. Should I let women remain oppressed? Well, is the interpretation of many people that um, Muslim women are very much oppressed by men within their culture. However, they would vehement, vehemently deny that and they would say, you know, we are being um, bigots. We're like um, Islamophobic. So in that particular scenario, like, I feel like, yes, they're oppressed. Um, yeah. Should I let women remain oppressed? Well, it's their choice to remain uh, oppressed in that circumstance, right? Here, like, um, this is actually less of a, like, Stop people from doing something, and it, this is more like controlling behavior. Um, more so than the other ones, because I feel like with rape and with murder, a lot of the time it's more spur of the moment. Yes, it can be pre-planned and all that sort of stuff, but here this is more like a systematic, like, denial of choice. A, a real... A real removal of free will. Should I let them remain oppressed? Yeah, sure. Sure. Yeah, I agree with this sentiment. Yeah, I mean, sure. Because one of the binary choices you made earlier does not jive with the other thing, 
because within the scope of the game I'm only going to let you choose three things maximum. Um, you're actually uh, a hypocritical piece of shit. Mm, Kurt. Okay. Uh, cool. Good to know. Nice. Nice. Oh my god. Huh. It seems like you're against capitalism, and yet you live in a society. Hmm. Curious. Curious. Very curious. I know. This is like full baited. Oh, and by the way, hello, Uzudu. Oh. <laughs> I hope you're well, dude. Yeah, this this is like full-on bait. Maybe you're just against how they plan to use it. <laughs> exactly, no. Yeah, this is like full bait. No, I said all that just in case we fail to stop it from happening. But you could have told me to not affect people at all, and it would be as if you had succeeded. What is it that you want, then? You made your point? No, nah, your point is not taken. We're just, we're just shooting the shit. You're talking about like an actual reality where you're going to change everything and, and, and mind control everyone. And then you're saying, oh, well, you, you know, you, you were trying to, to use the mind control in these circumstances. Get off my D, Akane. Get off my D. will stick with Supercontinental's plans if they get to control the MNA. Shit. Did game dumb. <laughs> Did game dumb. Ah, you two finally meet each other again. Oh, no greeting. Good saver. I know, I'm sorry. I just, I can't feel a thing. Can't feel a thing. The one thing that I hate about this game, like, it won't let you save scum. And I get why. It's like, ooh, replay value. But, nah, bruh. We ain't got time for that shit. I, I want to do this game 100% perfect in under two hours. So then I can get like a steam refund. <laughs> if only that was simple. Beep beep. Ferguson's. Yeah, what's up? Is marketing. Naima is the legal. Uh, Larissa was marketing. Wait, wait, I'm getting this screwed up. Diana was the um, the creator of the uh, the SPW project. Yeah, Larissa's marketing. Naima is legal. Edgar, who's Edgar? <laughs> 